Rasulullah wa ala alihi wa ashabihi wa mawala Rabbana yasir wa la ta'asir wa tammin bil khair wa rika nasa'in wa ya fatah ya alim Allahumma alimna ma yanfa'una wa ta'ala bima alam tana wa zidna ilma Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Last week alhamdulillah we discussed um, concentration Can everybody still remember? Right, how to concentrate? Who tried it? Anybody tried it? Did it work for you, Auntie? Robert? Okay, so definitely it takes practice, right? Obviously for us to own the skill of memorization and concentration, etc. Right? Uh, Sadie, how did your son do? How has he been doing? Has his memorization increased? By how much? Are you serious? Whoa. I think you're overworking, but okay. <laughs> Very nice, mashallah. Excellent, right? So one of the brothers, his son was not necessarily struggling, but um, there could have been a better way to do hib, uh, etc. Alhamdulillah. So he, we were doing some of these exercises, and like the brother said, his learning had improved. Alhamdulillah, right? So there's not no diff- the only difference between his son and us is our brains are a bit older. That's the only difference, alright? So some of the guys are close to 15, most of the ladies, what? It does not say your age for ladies, right? <laughs> okay, Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. So basically, the way we, we all understand how to memorize, right? Uh, sorry, how to concentrate. We have to look intensely, we have to recite loudly, and we have to listen. So sometimes we might recite loudly, but we don't listen. Sometimes we, 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 we try to listen, but we, because we're reciting softly, the brain is not taking in 100%, right? Sometimes we're not looking at what we're doing, so if everything has to work in sync, basically. And when this happens, you basically like an atom bomb, nothing can stop you, inshallah, right? Um, so basically, three times inside, three times outside. Three times inside, what I mean by this is, you will recite it looking inside, and then three times looking outside. Why you have to look inside? So even if you feel comfortable and you don't want to look inside, for example, it's a simple word, and you don't look inside at that time, you must understand that when you're going to try to picture, you won't be able to picture that. Because you have to build on something. Everybody with me? So for you to, to picture something, you must have seen something. Everybody with me? So to, 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 to basically strengthen the memorization, you have to look properly three times, then look properly outside three times. Everybody with me? And three plays a very uh, integral part, I think, in Islam. If you, if you study the prophetic tradition, you'd find the Prophet mentioning things three times because our brain sometimes needs about three times just to, to get in the Qibla. You know what I mean? Just to get the concentration properly, right? Okay. So what we're going to do is we will recite each word three times, then three times outside. Three times inside, three times outside. Then we go to the next word, three times inside, three times outside. And then we'll join the two words. And whilst we are learning, inshallah, we'll try to highlight some uh, common mistakes here and there so that we can try to improve them. And the nice thing about doing it in this way is because we're reciting the word a couple of times, we have an opportunity to practice it all the time. Are you with me? So sometimes we have this idea we have to recite the entire Quran. This is going to make our recitation properly. But actually, the Quran doesn't have different words all, all, all over the show. There's different words here and there, but if you're able to apply tajweed and proper recitation in one surah, for example, you'll be able to apply it everywhere else. Everybody with me? So don't have this idea, I'm going to tamat the whole Quran. So what? You could have tamat the whole Quran wrong. Not wrong, but necessarily, not necessarily in a, in, in a certain caliber, you know what I mean? So our intention is, whilst memorizing, we're going to apply the tajweed over here, so that we're able to apply it everywhere else as well. Everybody with me? Okay. أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم تبارك ال تبارك ال تبارك ال remember everybody has to be looking inside right now you're looking outside بسم الله say it three times again one more time الذي inside الذي Lavi Outside three times. Now inside. Tabarakal Lavi. Two more times. One more time. 
Now three times, uh, three times outside. Again. Again. Biadihil. Remember the lamb, tongue inside the mouth, right? Biadihil. Not heel. We're going over the heel. I love him, but heel side. Not heel. Heel. Heel, right? So we have to be aware of what we're doing with the, with the tongue. Initially, we're not aware. Because we speak, but if you say, think about what you're saying, you like be amazed where your mouth is going when you're saying words. Are you with me? But with with, with tajweed, we have to initially think about what we are saying, right? So, be a dihil. Again. One more time. Outside now, three times. Again. Again. Now three times inside. Tabaraka Ladi Biadihil. Again. One more time. Outside three times. Not heal, heal. Again. Mulk 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 Three times outside Mulk Again Mulk. Again Tabaraka alladhi biyadihi al-mulk Inside, right? Inside, we have to Again Oh, we never said it three times outside, right? Bismillah, three times outside. Again. Three times outside. Again. Again. Kulli shayin. Kulli shayin. Kulli shayin. Kulli shayin. Three times outside. Keep that for three seconds. Kulli shayin. Again. One more time. Now we join the two, right? Wa huwa ala kulli shay'in. Wa huwa ala kulli shay'in. Again. Wa huwa ala kulli shay'in. Again. Wa huwa ala kulli shay'in. Now answer. Wa huwa ala kulli shay'in. Qadeeb That right end is an empty mouth Alright Because it's a sakin Or it's a temporary sakin But before that it's a i Alright So a ra with a a or a u Is a full mouth ra So a ra and a ru But if it's a If there's a kasra on the ra Then it will be an empty mouth ra A ri Alright Same like Allah's name Allahu Rasulullah But if I say bil Billahi See empty mouth So same thing here Like the next verse you'll see is وَهُوَ الْعَزِيزُ الْغَفُورُ Then it's full mouth But this one over here is Empty mouth Right Qadeer Qadeer Again Qadeer Outside Qadeer Again Qadeer Shabir وَهُوَ عَلَى كُلِّ شَيْءٍ Qadeer it's not so long. I'm applying emphasis so that we become used to the sound and used to saying it like that, right? Bismillah. Again. Outside. Oh, but longer. Three seconds. Count on your fingers, right? One more time. Bismillah. Nice one, we lost that. Huh? 
Mas. Tabarakalladhi biyadihi al-mulk wa huwa ala kulli shay'in qadir. Bismillah. Tabarakalladhi Twice outside. Nice again. Nice. Some 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 of us are saying Alladhi, Alladhi. When you're saying a'a, you're saying a'in, right? So a'in is in the middle, we have to go deeper down. Alladhi. Nice. Three times inside. Alladhi. Again. Alladhi. One more time. Alladhi. Now three times outside. Alladhi. Again. Alladhi. One more time. Alladhi. Khalaqal. Khalaqal. Inside, right? Khalaqal. Khalaqal. Again. Outside. Again. Last time. Also, try to apply emphasis on the beginning of the words. We all know what's verbs and the right. The actual word, we know. Huruf zaida. We know extra letters. We never did that yet. So, say for example, I have. Yal guribu. What's the extra letter? Not quite. The yeah, right? So. The man, so, 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 when I'm reciting over there, for example, Khalaqa, that's the beginning of it, right? So when I'm reciting, I try to recite like this, Alladhi Khalaqa Al-Mawta. Can you see what I'm doing? I'm applying emphasis on the beginning of each word. Why? So that the ma'ana and the meaning comes out while I'm, uh, while I'm reciting. And when you're going to recite at home, and you're reciting, the meaning will be easier for you to picture, because you're seeing the words. Everybody with me? Right. Uh, we will be now. We we just finished Allah. Okay, Bismillah three times inside. Again, okay. the the lamb also not Khalaqal. Khalaqal. Jamil three times outside. Again, okay. one more time. Mashallah. Alladhi Khalaqal. Alladhi khalaqal Alladhi khalaqal One more time Alladhi khalaqal Now outside Alladhi khalaqal Last time Alladhi khalaqal Nice Mauta 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 Outside Mauta Again Mauta Again Alladhi khalaqa al-mawta Alladhi khalaqa al-mawta Again Alladhi khalaqa al-mawta Outside Alladhi khalaqa al-mawta Again Alladhi khalaqa al-mawta Wal-hayata 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 Outside Wal-hayata Again Wal-hayata Again Wal-hayata Alladhi khalaqa al-mawta wal-hayata Inside, twice Alladhi khalaqa al-mawta wal-hayata Again Alladhi khalaqa al-mawta wal-hayata Now twice outside Outside three times. Again. One more time. Alladhi 
خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم Again. الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم Now I'll take الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم Again. الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم 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 الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم One more time. I'll say it twice. أحسن 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 الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم أحسن الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم أحسن One more time. Everybody say it. Again. One more time. الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم أحسن عملا الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم أحسن عملا One more time inside الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم أحسن عملا Outside الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم أحسن عملا الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم أحسن عملا وهو العزيز الغفور وهو العزيز العزيز الغفور وهو العزيز الغفور وهو العزيز الغفور وهو العزيز الغفور أو تاتريتا وهو العزيز الغفور أجين وهو العزيز الغفور وانو تايم وهو العزيز الغفور الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم أحسن عملا وهو العزيز الغفور بسم الله الذي خلق الموت والحياة ليبلوكم أيكم أحسن عملا وهو العزيز الغفور إذن تبارك الذي بيدي الملك وهو على كل شيء قدير الذي 
خلق الموت والحياة ليبنوكم أيكم أحسن عملا وهو العزيز الغفور بسم الله But in that three seconds. From memory, Bismillah. People say Tabarak al Tabarak al Kaf Kaf Right? Bismillah Tabarak Tabarak al I know many of you know the Tawadidi, right? But many of us, we can recite Tabarak in a crowd. Isn't it so? Try to recite Tabarak alone. Well, people tell you, Ikkin Tabarak, Ani Khadat. I say, okay, interesting. Because we understand the flow because we've re- re- recited it hundreds and thousands of times already. But if you do it like this, you'll be able to recite Tabarak on your own without needing to recite it in a crowd. You'll be able to lead the crowd, inshallah. Hmm. Right? Um, the reason why some places are win instead of three times, two times, is because um, we, we know this already. Right? So, for example, Wahua, everybody's heard Wahua already. Don't do Wahua ten times. No. Wahua ala, because you know the two words. But don't take huge words because the brain works in small sections at a time. The brain doesn't memorize big sections, right? Um, any questions? Ma? No questions? Everybody understood 100 percent What's the empty mouth or all? What? <laughs> what causes a raw to be empty mouth? A kasra, Jamil. Right? So a kasra or before it is a kasra and it's sakin, or before that sakin is a kasra also. For example, a qadir. The dal and sorry, the ya and the ra is sakin. But the Tao has an effect on, on the Ra. Is everybody with me? So a Ra with a E is a Ri. And a Ra with a A is a Ra. Or with a O is a Ru. Full mouth. Alright? So that's number one. Number two is this a Lam. The tongue must not come out of the mouth. <laughs> the tongue must be inside the mouth. Everybody with me? And you must think about what you're doing. Don't. Sometimes what we have a habit of is we repeat it hundred times. MashaAllah, you get reward for it. But we repeat it without thinking about what we're doing. Is everybody with me? So repeat, but just be aware. Where is my tongue actually going when I say, um, Tabarakal, no, okay, Kalla, there's no more. Be at the hill. Be at the hill. Where's my tongue going? Be at the hill. Huh? My tongue's actually coming out. Be at the hill. Oh, this is what he meant. Everybody with me? And then will the, it will start becoming an, uh, a natural thing of recitation. But with me, in Bismillah, no questions. Everybody understood hundred percent. Okay. Oh yeah. By the way, there's no homework, right? We'll just continue like this. You see, what's going to happen is because when we get into the flow of things, in this half an hour that we have, remember we because most of us can recite. We all of us can recite Alhamdulillah. So this, the the manner that we are doing it is going to improve the recitation, obviously, and we also try to memorize. Don't kill yourself on memorization because you don't have homework. Just read this the whole week. You know what I mean? If you make mistakes, what must you do? Relearn it. Must you relearn it? No. Don't relearn it, please. Alright? 
and I see it's on YouTube. Whoever else sees it, right? Of the other classes, I might not have mentioned it there. I think I mentioned it over there. If you make a mistake, don't stress your brain out. You never make a murtad, right? And you never, no, really, because you can stress my, oh my God, I can I, and I learned it. No, it's fine. Pause, look at the mistake, say the mistake out loud, then start from the beginning again from memory and think about the mistake. But don't go again, for example, you're making a mistake, tabarak ala ribi adil muk, milk. No, just, oh, it's mulk. Don't go again, tabarak, 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 oh, he tabarak, hundred times the verse, hundred times. No, look at mulk. Okay, it's mulk. We hear what the sound like and we feel it, okay. Tabarak ala ribi adil muk. Do you understand? The brain will work like that, but you have to engage with your brain as well. Is what it was me. But don't, don't recreate the wheel. If you've memorized it already, it's there. Just tap into it again. But if you're going to re try to redo it again, you might just redo the whole thing in your head. Then more frustration is going to kick in. So what you do is, don't relearn today. Just read it in your memory. If you make it a mistake, just check. Okay, that's where the mistake is said out loud. Start again from the beginning. Bro, you got that flow. Now, obviously, you know this piece, but the more we're going to go on in show, right? Don't allow frustration to come to you. And another thing, if you become frustrated, say, I will be like a on Because sometimes the mind believes that we can overcome the Quran. It's not our book, it's Allah's book. So we apply ourselves, we say, Bismillah, we try our best, we ask Allah to grant it to us, inshallah. All right? No questions? Subhanallah, I know I have no question because it's break time. Subhanallah, I have no question. 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 Subhanallah, I have no question.